Welcome to my blog. <laughs> okay, today we are recording uh, how to make database app again and again and again. To the repetition helps. So I'm going to start from the very start. Now record the screen. This is the idea of making a PHP web app. We install the VM and we fight with the network. We test PHP. When the network is okay, I immediately test PHP. And then I test Postgres connection. Of course, it will fail because I don't know the password. We try to find how to set the password. There is a way how to change the password if you forget the password. And we don't know the password, so we are just following this. I already know this, but that's what I did last time. But this one is the automatic way to edit something. It's very hard to explain, but actually we can just edit this file, replace the MD5 with trust, and then restart the Postgres, and then change the Postgres default password, and then edit again. Put it back to MD5, restart, and now you can use the Postgres password. And then make, and then when the PHP connects to Postgres, you can just continue making uh, the database up. Right? So today we are going to just do it again because repetition helps. So I downloaded the original, where is our downloads? From the original, ito yung dinownload nyo, di ba? Bitnami LAPP. I will click again and it will be a new computer. <laughs> it will be a new computer. I will name it. Agree without reading. Importing appliance. So I have many new comp I have many computers now here. The settings while it's configuring, I will put the settings network setting to a host only adapter. This one host only adapter because that my experiment that's what works in this network. And when this finishes, I'm just going to start it login with Bitnami Bitnami. Okay. We start now. Okay, let me rename it first, Pala. Sorry. Web app. I'm going to make a Bible search web app. <laughs> Seek ye first God's kingdom, and all the other web apps will, will, be, will follow. Okay. We are going to make a Bible search. Powering up the end. Enter. The more web apps we make, the more easier it is to make web apps. It is training our mind. Okay. Okay, I'm going to log in with Bitnami, the default password, and Bitnami, the default password, uh, username and password. Now it's asking me for, to make a new password. I'm going to make my my secret password and it didn't work anyway I want to know my IP address immediately so I'm going to type IP ADDR show IP address is 192.168.56.104 I open my browser immediately and type 192.168.56.104 and there is nothing because my computer is configured to use a proxy server therefore we have to turn the proxy server for this computer i'll just add i just add this ip address to this list so that 
local traffic will ay, 104 okay we got a response from our from our bitnami now i'm going to sudo bash and go to opt i know where it is opt bitnami apache htdocs this is where all the html lives and i'm going to make a try.php there's no joke pico try.php just to try php control o is saved and then i'm going to put here try.php aha i got hello next we need postgres control x is equipped there is a there is an instruction here how to reset password because we don't know the password of postgres I don't know how but I just took, I don't know what it is so that this will scale yeah we scale it just like this class so according to the instructions you edit we are going to edit this file so I'm going to go to ano pa yung nakalagay and then I'm going to pick up uh, pghba.conf and then I'm going to change this to trust so that it will not ask password control save save is control O exit is control X and then I'm going to restart Postgres how do I restart Postgres? Postgres CTL reload. Uh, oh, really? Postgres. Wait, wait, wait. What's the command? I'm command I. The command is CPG CTL reload. You cannot run as root. Okay, okay. Let me obey. So do Kulang ng you. Sorry, 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 sorry. But I am under class. No database in directory specified and environment variable. I don't know what is wrong. Okay. I will just reboot the whole computer. So do init 6. When we don't know what to do, reboot. <clears throat> Bit nami. Hmm, pinalta ko na password nito. Mali. So, psql-l, psql-u, postgres, oh, no more password, I can log in to postgres from local using the user postgres. Now, we are going to set the password, as ano yung alter password. So, I'm going to type alter user postgres with password. Lalagyan ko lang ng A 
Okay na. I set the password of Postgres to A. And in it, reboot again. Reboot. Okay, reboot, reboot. When the computer starts back, we already have the Postgres password. Username is Postgres. Password is A. We will test Postgres connection now. I'm just going to go to opt opt slash bitnami slash apache slash htdocs and we will edit our try that php and we are going to try to connect to the database how do you connect to the database very easy pg connect db host local host user postgres password a if not con die cannot connect error connecting to database okay only like that we will see if it will have where is our try? Oh, error talaga yan. <laughs> What's the wrong? Siguro walang DB. I suspect it's wrong spelling. PG connect lang. Let me try to run it here. Syntax error. You know you can run PHP in by just typing like that. Bakit syntax error class? Ay walang semicolon. Kayo talaga hindi kayo nagsasabi. Control O. Walang semicolon sa dulo. Hello! That means there is no error. Ha ha ha. Let's try to put an SQL statement. Select 1, 2, 3. From nowhere. If result uh, PG query. You query the connection with this query. SQL. If it returns null, there is error. Okay. Otherwise, we are going to echo the result. Wow. R00. Zero, zero. Line 0, column 0. Dapat mag-display siya ng 1, 2, 3. Hey. problem is there is a cache so it's delayed I'm going to just try to execute Uy. I pressed the wrong button control X PHP try that PHP it says one two three hello do you see it We can just create tables and uh, put the whole Bible inside and we can create queries. Okay, let's make a Bible. Uh, where do I find the whole Bible? From the internet. Let's find. Where can I find Bible? There are so many, my friends.
where is it? Ah, oh, ID table version English. Baka naman meron akong kopya dito. Okay, SQL. I'm just looking for King James. Ito. Tingnan natin kung totoo ito. You can just copy the whole Bible from somewhere. The links are broken. Bible.txt page not found Ito kaya. Ano kaya yung itsura nito, class? Okay. We can just copy and paste the whole thing. My SQL. Let's see it, if it will work. Paano ito kopihin papunta dun sa BDN? Marali lang yan. Iyan yung URL. And we are going to restart with network. How to copy something into the VM from the internet? We are going to use NAT. NAT. Of course, we are going to restart. New network. I told you about this already before, but I did not show you. We are going to copy the Bible from somewhere in the internet to the inside the VM. And I have to configure the VM to be NAT so that it can connect to net to internet. I just need to set export HTTP proxy equals HTTP colon Slash slash one nine two one six eight fifteen dot one colon three one two eight three one two eight. This is the configuration in the lab. HTTP proxy also same. And then I'm going to w get okay. I can ping proxy. I'm going to w get the URL. Ang tanong ko pang isa is, how do you copy a long URL and paste it to this VM? May paste ba dito? Click the mouse. How do you paste? Okay. How to paste Oracle VM virtual box. Right click and select copy. Press Ctrl C. In the VM, click where you want to paste and Ctrl V. Baka Ctrl V nga. Wala. Control C is tough. That means I have to type this very long URL. No problem. Perfect. 
Walang W gate. App install W gate. App update. Name server I don't know how to. I cannot reach name server it should be this is the problem we are we are left to the HTTP There must be something wrong with my setting Yun, 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 yun. It's updating. Maybe I should. Panamag. Sudo bash. Ayan no. Sudo bash. Maging ang root ka lang. Direct siya lang. Naging root. So these are the commands pala to set the internet working. So I can download from the internet. Baka pwede nang hindi na mag-update. App install wget. Wala. Kailangan ko talaga mag-update. Yes, I'm downloading WGET. Okay, now I can get my file. Vietnami Apache HTDocs. Kunin ko yung Bible that. Nasa na yung mahaba kong tinipe. Ayoko nang itype ulit. Tinipe na ako kanina ito. Not found. Row got GitHub. Maling spelling lang. GitHub. Tama naman. GitHub. Row dot GitHub user content dot com. Scroll mapper Bible database data. Ito kulang ng a. Ha 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 ha. Downloading the whole Bible in one second. <laughs> Ngayon, subukan natin kung papasok ito sa ano, PSQL.
create okay i will just put the whatever file empty tika lang ano saan yung dinownload ko tkjv that sql i'm going to input it itong backslash i class it will it will i will type backslash i in and then the file name it will take all the contents of that sql as input to the to uh, no, to this and we will see what happens because the this is postgres and the sql is for i uh, know see ayo gumana because this is for my sql let's look for something postgres uh, kjv.sql for postgres Ito. Ito, ito, ito. TY naman to. May Python ba dito, class? Tingnan nga natin. Walang Python. Why didn't they just give the dump? Where is the dump? Bible versus table that SQL. SQL light dito may SQL light. Baka ito. Subukan natin to. We are looking for something that tinayata yung sinubukan natin. Okay, let me try this. Row git user scroll mapper Bible database master master slash Ayaw, ayaw, ayaw. Let's look for another one. Something very simple. You know what? I will just CMD to IO list and find it there.
cannot connect to ILS. Host is down. Oh, I cannot connect to SSH. Sorry, sorry. Uh, TSQL, baka ito. Try this one. Mm, master TSQL slash DBO T underscore KJV SQL. Dami na natin na download. Walang gumagana. Ano pangalan ng bago? DBO naman to. Invalid sequence encoding. Okay, next. Next file. Wala bang mas simple dito? Yung simple lang. ito na ano URL somewhere here there's supposed to be kjv that sql that txt Ito, ito, ito. Parang mas malapit ito sa katotohanan. Nasaan yung files? Importing database dropping files. Where are the files? instruction naman ito Okay, we cannot find the Bible. We can just create a table Bible. Reference. Text. And verse is <coughs> text. Insert into Bible values. Genesis 1.1. Okay. 
let's just memorize our Bible. Exodus 20, uh, 20 verse 8. Remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. <laughs> pang gusto natin ilagay. Ephesians 2.8 uh, John Okay. Nasaan na yung ating Bible app? Uh, Sudo bash. Because we have only few minutes more. Let's hurry up. Bitnami Apache HT Docs. Select asterisk from Bible. Tingnan natin kung nag-load to na sa nang ating select asterisk from Bible. It just says hello. I can't believe it's so hard to find the kjv.sql. cannot contact our server because it configured our network uh, to be not dapat yung network natin ay host only and reboot okay hurry 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 Tingnan ulit. Reload. Wala pa. Genesis 1-1. Oh, lumabas na ang Genesis 1-1. Siyempre, yun yung laman ng ano eh. Bitnami Apache HT Docs Pico Try.php Na-stack tayo kakahanap ng Bible O, oh, diba? Select So, if I can just put uh, for $i equals 0 $i is less than PG Num rows $r $i++ plus plus close it and say something like this dollar i dollar j right i have another one fields dollar r dollar j plus plus and then tab so that uh, we will display oy, so that we will display all of the bible verses and bible texts in our bible that has only three verses may error daw class hindi niya sinabi kung nasaan nasa line 9 
line 9 1 2 3 PG num fields R Bakit anong problema J J less than PG num fields San Galing Yon Galing 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 Yun yun din ginagawa ko ng sudyante ako eh Hindi mahanap ng teacher yung error Oh Dito, mamaya pa yan, after 1 minute lalabas. Delay kasi yung pass. Pero lumalabas na dyan sa ilalim, di ba? So, meron na tayong... Ano? Meron na tayong database app. Siyempre, lalagyan natin ng ano. lalagyan natin class ng ng text box PG escape string para hindi tayo mahak. Ayun, kailangan 'yan. Oh. Sabat. Ayaw. Bakit ganun class? Where reverse is Sorry, sorry, sorry. Wala na, time na. Oh, life. Ba't lumalabas pa rin yung sabat? Ah. Kibang ko kung ba't ganyan. Oh, di ba di ba di ba? Ayos na. Pag tinight ko God, yung may mga God lang na verse. Oh, di ba? Mayroon na tayong sa Bible search engine. Di ba di ba? Tatlo lang yung verse natin eh. <laughs> yung may mga letter E. Oh, lahat sila may letter E. Oh, mayroon na tayong search engine for Bible. But yung Bible natin, three verses lang laman. <laughs> We spend a lot of time looking for KJV.SQL. I'm surprised it's very hard to find. <clears throat> it's everywhere. It's in the internet. Okay. Till next time, click subscribe. <laughs> so to summarize, that's uh, uh, one. And then, how to make a Bible app and get lost looking for the Bible. 
<laughs> okay, let's pray. Our Father in heaven, thank you for the opportunity to learn and to teach and to make a Bible app, very simple one. Please continue to guide us and lead us, Lord, especially my students. Thank you for hearing our prayers. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay, I know you have a class here. Ako na upload kasi darating na si Sir Abner. Gano'n ba kalaki yung file? Malaki yun kasi ito. Uy! Ulo! Hindi.